I'm Scott Samuel here at the Culinary Institute of America at Greystone in Napa Valley. Today I'm going to show you how to make a spicy black bean and chicken tostada with avocado, lettuce, and sour cream. It's a really nice recipe incorporating black beans spiced up with serrano, fajita chicken strips, and topped with lettuce, sour cream, avocado, and tomato. Let's take a look at the ingredients. So the first step I want to make will be the, the black bean base. And it's a spicy black bean. I'm using canned black beans. So I'm going to add a, a little canola oil to the pan. And I'm going to cook my serrano pepper that I've diced with the seeds in. Taking the stem off. Serrano pepper. Garlic. I'm going to cook this down to get a nice little bit of color. Pinch of salt. And then I'll add my black beans. And this is something that can be done ahead of time. These are canned black beans that have been drained and rinsed. And we were just going to incorporate a garlic and serrano flavor to them. We'll cook them ahead of time, cool them. And then we're going to work on the chicken. This recipe has been written for the fajita chicken strips that high schools get. And I've made my own uh, fajita chicken strips here with uh, chicken thighs and uh, chili powder and cayenne and uh, Mexican oregano. So these are the main components of it. And then we're going to go ahead and uh, cut some iceberg lettuce, chop some cilantro, a little bit of sour cream, mozzarella, tomatoes, and diced avocado and hot sauce. So once we have the two main components together, we'll work on the toppings and then we'll build a couple tostadas on my uh, fried corn tortillas. All right, so a little bit of color here on our serrano and garlic. All right, we'll let these simmer for about five or 10 minutes just to infuse the flavor. Break down the beans a little bit. So let's get the toppings ready. We're just gonna go ahead and uh, cut, or known as chiffonade, a little bit of this iceberg lettuce. So this is something I wanna do at the last second so the lettuce stays fresh. But once we have all these components, we'll be ready to assemble. So I'm going to be using the lettuce, the cilantro, the cheese, a little bit of tomato, sour cream. And let's go ahead and dice some avocado. So you notice I'm not slicing in my hand. I want to scoop out the avocado. Do a simple dice on it. All right, these beans are almost done. They smell good. I'm going to give it a pinch of uh, pepper and a pinch of salt. All right, so the chicken fajita strips, uh, if you get these pre-done, um, you don't have to make them, but what I did is I took uh, chicken thighs and took the skin off and took the bone, bones off and tossed it with a little bit of chili powder, cayenne, Mexican oregano and salt, and then just sauteed them on high heat. Okay, so our beans are done. They are hot. Let's go ahead and assemble one of these uh, tostadas. So I like to go ahead and uh, top with warm beans. And if I was doing this in a high school setting, I would have the, the beans and the chicken warm and then all of the toppings separate so that they can be assembled uh, as the students come down the lunch line. So a little bit of a fajita chicken. A little bit of lettuce. Put a sour cream. And we're going to go with just a touch of hot sauce, a little bit more spiciness. That's optional. Dot with the avocado. Put a mozzarella cheese and uh, tomatoes. Here's our spicy black bean and chicken tostada with avocado, lettuce, and sour cream. And I've added a little bit of cilantro for garnish.